How is it going everybody? You're watching Then About Tech and Apple has just released its latest update to iOS 18, iOS 18.3.1. And this software update specifically is here for one simple reason. It actually just changes one thing, but it is a very important thing. It's a major security vulnerability. Guys, I have to tell you, this is very, very serious. Let me explain. Okay, so this is the story. A major security vulnerability was found inside both iOS and iPadOS, and it could allow someone with bad intentions, of course, to have access to all of your data and files inside your iPhone and your iPad, even when they are locked. So even if it is passcode lock like that, which we think they're completely 100% safe, right? Nope, with this vulnerability, they're able to actually bypass and actually have access to all of your data and files on your iPhone or your iPad. And if you ask me, this is pretty much the biggest security vulnerability there is because we always think that we are safe when we have our devices locked with passcode and face ID and so on. But with this, they would be able to just like that get all of our data and files. It doesn't get more critical than that. Let's see what Apple has to say about this. If we go to this website, which is about the security content of iOS, of course, I'm gonna have it right here in the description. This is an Apple support website and under iOS 18.3.1 and iPadOS 18.3.1, they have here impact. So where they actually describe the issue. So a physical attack may disable USB restricted mode. I'm going to talk about that in a second on a locked device. Apple is aware of a report that this issue may have been exploited in an extremely sophisticated attack against specific targeted individuals. But the thing is, everyone knows about this vulnerability, especially now that everyone's talking about it. So what you have to do is update your iPhone to iOS 18.3.1 right now because if you are in any iOS version previous than that, your iPhone or your iPad could actually be a victim of this attack. As you know, and as I've mentioned many times here in this video, this is a physical attack, so it would require someone to actually have in possession, have your iPhone with them and then plug it in. But anyways, this is a very, very serious thing. So don't think this is just for specific people. This is very sophisticated. It would never happen to me. Like, don't think about this. Just go ahead, update your iPhone right now to 18.3.1 and your iPad as well. And just make sure you don't have the possibility of facing this specific issue. Apart from that, there's nothing new in iOS 18.3.1. No new features, no changes, nothing new with performance and battery, nothing like that. This software update was built specifically to fix this very, very important issue and vulnerability. So go ahead had update now and of course stay tuned to Denabaltech always the best content on Apple see you later guys